do not expect people to invest in you if you don't invest in yourself Why should someone invest in you if you don't care about yourself? You need to encourage people to want to invest in you. And in order for you to do that, you need to bring value to your own life and then bring value into other people's life. Because in this day, okay, it could be their time, money, uh, advice, anything, anything that is considered an investment. And investments could also be emotional, could be mental. So therefore, why should someone invest in you if you don't deserve it or if you don't even invest in yourself you know for people to give you their time you need to bring value to their life it's not free in this life nothing is for free you know when it comes to the law of energy nothing changes and only changes form that is lost sorry when it comes to the law of energy nothing is, is lost everything changes in form so apply that same scenario to life in order for me to give you my time or my advice you need to be willing to watch my videos <laughs> isn't that funny i don't know what i'm talking about myself but it is just an example if what i'm bringing into your life <laughs> like and comment and subscribe okay so but i mean i'm just saying you need to create value to make people valuable uh to give people the courage and the envy to want to help you life doesn't just happen in the air whereby you think you can come in and give your bare minimum and expect people to invest into that. No, quality is what people are looking for. What type of quality are you bringing into their lives? What are you doing? What are you, what are you doing for them? It's a trade-off. What are you doing for me and what am I doing for you? We need to both benefit, symbiotic relationship, whereby both parties are benefiting. You watching my videos because you like what I'm delivering? And what I'm delivering is bringing value into your life. So in your lives out there, let's talk about your relationship or your work achievement or whatever. You want to get a promotion, you need to invest into your job. What are you doing in order for you to get that promotion? The promotion isn't going to come out of the blue. They're going to look at your work ethic. What type of value are you bringing to the company you're working for? What type of value are you bringing into your relationship? If you want your partner to invest in you, if you want the ring, if you want the engagement, or if you want uh, I mean, whatever it is that you're trying to achieve in your life, you need to, to, to bring value beyond, you know, what they cannot get outside of that. You get it? You need to stand out in order for people to invest in you. And that's just the law of life. People like the easiest way out. The easiest way out is too easy. It doesn't require an investment. No one should invest in that. Because it's easy. Remember in life, what is free is not respected. And what is easy is not that respected either. If it's too easy, then it doesn't get attention, people's attention. I don't want it if it's too easy. I'm not saying it should be hard. That's the same law in the same scenario. But the, the act of working towards it and investing into it is the challenge. People, people like for things to challenge them. People are looking for something that will challenge them. It gets their attention. And therefore, they are more willing to invest into a challenge than something that is too easy to get. It's like a girl that is easy to get. Men don't invest in her like that. There's no need. Unless she wants fun. Because some women want fun. They don't even want you to invest in them. They're there for the fun tag. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about a woman who wants a man to take it serious. She wants a serious relationship. She wants marriage. She wants to be engaged. She wants all the benefit that comes with it. In order for that man to invest in you, you need to bring value into his life. Now we're not talking about relationship. Oh no, we're talking about fitness. You need to be able and willing to invest into your fitness journey in order for you to see a result. The result could be your health or your aesthetic. What type of investment are you, are you making? in order for you to achieve that. It's not going to come free. It's not going to happen in your dream. Your dream are just your dream. We are talking about reality. When you wake up and look at yourself in the mirror, ask yourself these questions. What type of investment and value am I bringing to myself in order for me to get the result I want in this fitness area or in this life or whatever it is you're trying to achieve? You need to put in the work in order for you to get the results. The easiest way out is no way out. Remember that. Now let's just help and just what? Our dream and invest in ourselves. Okay? Bye.